guys, so today, before I start this haul video, I have to put a disclaimer, because a disclaimer is very, very, um, necessary, I guess. Now, I never really thought I had to put these, because I never really, I always thought, you know, people actually know, but that is not the case. If I do not put a disclaimer, you got all these comments, you shop a lot, da 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 da, -da. you, whatever. So, I want to start off by saying that this is a haul video. Hauling means I went out, I bought stuff, and I'm going to show you what's out there. I want to show you ways to put it together, and I want to show you what I got. So, you can check that out on my blog. If you do not like watching haul videos for some reason, you just don't like watching them, if they put you down and they make you feel bad, do what I would do. I would just not watch it. If something makes me feel bad, don't watch it. Don't make yourself feel bad, you know. It's just that simple. This is for my subscribers. They enjoy my haul videos, and I know they enjoy them because I enjoy making them too. So if you don't, then just watch another one of my makeup tutorials or whatever else you like watching on YouTube. But this is definitely not, um, this is definitely a haul video. Alright? So now that you know what it is and what it's going to be about, um, I'll start. So obviously, by the title, you already know where I got all this stuff, and I'll start off with the accessories. I got a lot of party stuff, though, for clothing. Um, so I got this cuff with a bunch of, like, gems and pearls and stuff like that. It's really cute. It's clustered. Um, a clustered cuff, I believe that's what it's called. It looks like this. So really nice big statement um, piece. I also got some rings. I got this one which is one of my favorite um, additions to my wardrobe. It's really um, a great color that goes with a lot of stuff. And I also got this pyramid ring and gold and some diamonds on it. Looks like this. Pow! <laughs> and I also got this one! gorgeous beauty. It looks like this. I got really scrawny hands, huh? And it has a black gem on top. And I really like vintage looking stuff, so Forever 21 has like good knockoffs that like, like a brooch or something. That's what I got. And I got this one. I really wish I owned an authentic brooch like from the 1700s this is freaking gorgeous I love it and like I said you just kinda stick it on your clothes if you want I really like those and I also got this necklace just pretty much chains and it has some gems hanging off so like just different colored ones like this so the jewelry that I got, it's really like out there and bold, but it's like the type of things that I like. Like I don't care. Like just remember, there's always gonna be rules, but it's really fun to break the rules in fashion. Um. <clears throat> okay, so I got that, and I also got this um, necklace that I'm wearing today. It's from the same place. It looks like this. Really cute, and it's really simple. It's thin. It has not a lot of details to it but this is like by far one of the most simple necklaces you can have well obviously you have like a plain chain but what I mean is that considering the kind of jewelry that I get this is pretty like minimal to me and I like that especially with my shoulder pads that I am loving um, something like this is really great to just kinda if you wanna wear jewelry no earrings keep it simple if you have something like this dramatic um, so the shoes I will be modeling, and I will be showing you the clothes, so let me just stand up. First thing that I got is this dress, and this one is like just a silver sequin dress, and I know it looks like really huge, but it actually fits me pretty good, and the length is really good as well. The only thing is that I got to cut about an inch and a half, and then sew it, so it fits me like this, because right now it's like, showing my boob and stuff so I was like um no <clears throat> but I kind of want to wear this for Christmas still not sure but it's a really fun party dress I also got this Hello Kitty just simple sweater 
I mean, Hello Kitty simple sweater. And it's white, with Hello Kitty, and in the back it says, Hello Kitty. So for all you Hello Kitty fans, um, here we have another shirt. I thought it was so cute. It says, Nerds Need Love Too. And then it has this cute little nerd. I just find them so adorable. It's just a simple white tee, and it's really great to layer. Um, it's really great if you want to use like leather jackets or leggings, especially since it's pretty long and the back area is longer, so you don't want to show your booty. Here we have a iCat romper, and it's a strap. It's strapless. Favorite purchase is this blazer, sequined blazer really really hot right now and especially if they have padded um, shoulders so shoulder pads really awesome you know I love them so here we have this this is um, extra small and it fits really good so here it is it has some pockets on the side you should definitely invest in one of these these are really cute not invest but you should definitely get one these are really nice got this um, black tank top then it has a smiley face with the top hat. And again, just a bunch of sequins. It's plain in the back. Simple. I like wearing something like this with French boots. So it says Smart Cookie. And again, it's pretty long. Kind of like up to here. I don't know if you remember in my Sarah haul, I mentioned that I mentioned that I got some shoes from Aldo and I bought them. Well, I saw them online, went to the store didn't get them there um, they didn't have them there so I the lady got them online for me and I bought them on Sunday and they came in the mail Tuesday so that quick these are the babies that I was talking about super cute huge platform leather <sighs> I, I don't know I'm not like like I don't like leather that much because of the what's behind it but I'm not like this crazy anti-leather person I know it's kinda bad so here we go and this is how they look from the front they're so cute I'm gonna model all the boots and shoes that I got today and then that would complete the video here are the rosemore pumps that I got from Aldo really cute I love the platform and yeah so here's the front this is what I like about it it's just kinda like comes up through here. So here are the gold glitter pumps that I got from Forever 21 and these are very um, sparkly as you can see. So the glitter doesn't come off as easily as you would think it would. Their peep toe is a silver pair of pumps. Pretty much the same thing. These are actually quite comfortable. The heel is not that high so I could you know, if I wanted to, I could take these to class, but I'm really not the type of girl to take heels to class unless it's a small heel on a boot. So, here they are. They have a bow in the front. And, again, these are very comfortable. You can take these to the mall if you wanted to. If you wanted to dress up a little more, and maybe you want to go to the mall and you want to wear heels, I would recommend something like this. It's not a kitten heel, but it's a little bigger than a kitten heel. Here are some boots that I got. And here's the problem. These are a size 6 from Forever 21. And the thing about these is that these are like a 6.5 or 7. Even though they say 6, these are so big on me. They're about a, well, they're actually about half an inch bigger. And they look pretty big, but you can't take them at like. These boots were $32, so it's not worth for me to go take them to the shoe repair and get them fixed. But, yeah, I might just get padding inside so my feet don't slide around. But I really like these biker boots, especially for, um, since it's getting really cold now. But, I don't know, they make my feet look big. I'm like, damn, my feet are not even this big. So, yeah, I might get some other ones because seriously, that's like a huge foot. My toe is like right here. So, it's like all of this is extra. But, love some still. And I did try to return them. And, oh no. I was going to return them, but they start measuring from six 
and up, like six, seven, eight, and nine. So they don't have a five and a half, because I was going to get a five and a half. So this is the only time that the sizes have failed on me from Forever 21. Everything else that I've ever bought, any other pair of shoes, even boots, they've been um, true to size. Like, I have these from last year from Forever 21, and these are a six. And look, look how much smaller these are. These are some black military boots that I got. Pointy toe. The heel is pretty high, actually. The heel is about the same, three and a half inches. And, yeah, these are not that comfortable, though. I have to admit, really got to get used to these. That's how they look.